being prepped for takeoff. Yeah! Get your ass back here! Launch party! So the rocket is ready. It's time to reap the benefits of being in space. Alright. Maybe just take a look around this cool rooftop garden. Oh, I'm about to run out of range. Okay. Let's get out of here. Specifically, let's get out to here. So, what are we going to be able to do with this balloon satellite and a Galilei rocket? It's not totally clear what will be accomplished. Something cool, probably. Launch waits. Oh, Wesley. Clearly Cisco. Jake Cisco. Captain Cisco. <laughs> we are minutes away from having Bloom at our mercy. Well, we're gonna cook the shit out of their goose. T minus 20, 19, 18, 17, 95, Cordy, Google Black. Ranch. I'm just imagining that big data load is enough to get me to half mast and touching cloth at the same freaking time. Three. Please. Two, one, one. And let it yeah. <laughs> Woo. Nice. I like the reprise of the factory music there. All right, it's time to hack the planet. I assume. What's Marcus doing here? Typing. Oh shit. What is this? Oh my god. <laughs> Holy shit. Holy, look at that. Hell of a view up here. Time to blow the living shit out of Bloom. Bloom's network covers even more globe than we thought. Even a web this complex has to have a way in. Somewhere. I'm picking up some points of entry. A few of these data hubs have their share of vulnerabilities. Holy shit. Love it. Let's go. <laughs> I'm I'm literally chortling. Oh my god. So that's the goal to get in there. And I can use this satellite network to get around the world. Oh my god. <gasps> wow. Let's see if I can find Australia. A server farm in Dubai, but first I gotta find Australia. Ah, oh, what kind of bullshit satellites are these? Oh, of course it's dark on that side of the planet. Well, okay. Look at all this tech! Wrench, am I drooling? I'm sorry, I can't hear you over the sound of me drooling. You know your way around these servers, Joshua? I think I can speak to them. Oh man. So neither of them has the key. Uh -huh. oh, someone's getting a tour, that's convenient. Oh, I'm pretty Jack fan. <laughs> How do I get the key? Hmm. Can I get to one of the admins? If these guys don't have the key, who does? Oh. Seamless operational uptime. Nice. Oh shit, there we go. 
the greatest A gap in history. <laughs> Mashallah, an entirely space based network inaccessible to the most ingenious of all hackers. Wrong. It was, it was inaccessible to everyone except the most ingenious of hackers. Alright, so I think we're warning intrusion detected indeed. Oh shit, the ten blue! Josh, you are definitely the man! Uh, thank you, Ray. <laughs> okay. A power plant in Seoul, Korea. This is awesome, by the way. I love the concept of what's going on here. The room offices are in Yongsan. Let's make some music. Problem. SML gateway with adaptive security. No way through it. I could spend months and still get nowhere with this. No, there is always a way. Hey, what happens to data centers during a power outage? Their UPS kicks in. What else? What if that goes too? The firewall would drop. We'd be one step closer to Delaware. Wrench, that's brilliant. You should do that. Funny you should say that, Satara. What? What? Oh shit, the electrical grid. 36 Come on, the UPS is kicking. Am I supposed to do something here? I can't seem to activate any of these workstations. Hmm. Not clear what I can do here. Nothing, maybe? It's a bit weird. Surely I'm meant to be, like, doing a thing. Affecting the grid by. Oh shit, I should have a look at the picture changing. Ah! The grid. Gotta take it all down. I get it. Oh, just one node left. Ah. Got him. <laughs> this poor guy. These operations people. This is admin's nightmare. I feel like this is irresponsible actually of us. We're fucked. I hope they didn't like take down the electrical grid of Seoul or something. Oh my god. Alright. What the fuck did you do, Wrench? Shut down the power. Any other requests? <laughs> Why use a hammer when you have a wrench? That's what I'm about. Yeah, I pulled a stunt like that once, Wrench. Riots ensued. People died. Not that kind of thing doesn't bother you. Yeah, I was thinking about that. Probably a lot of people relying on the power grid. Oh well, it's still cool. Can't get to Delaware yet. Hmm, that's a heck of a node there. I don't think I have quite enough roots in. Oh, what was that? What was that? I spotted something. Hmm. Someone mentioned Yongsan. I don't know where that is, however. Are these geosynchronous? I think I'm going in a single circle around the planet. I 
would make sense. So what node? Aha! Dublin. EU office probably. Welcome to Dublin, Ireland, boys. Ah, I thought this was Dublin, Ohio. Let's look around, make ourselves at home. Gonna need an access key there. <clears throat> Full time scores. <laughs> what? I think you'll find everything here in ship shape. The I accents. Know. It doesn't hurt to take a look. Someone's chat. Don't get me wrong. I think security audits are a good practice. Uh huh. Network alarm. Oh dear, that's gonna upset them. Pinky Bedoni, what the hell? Jesus Christ. Look, I better look after this. And circle back shortly. Don't touch it. Hmm. Arsehole. So this guy's some kind of admin. If I can follow him somehow, I might be able to get an access key. Are you love? Okay. Security guru locked my PC. Now I'm waiting around with me hand up my bum. Aha. Cool. All right. So Is here's that? her passwords. Now. Wow. All right. I'll do it when I'm home. There you go. Right. It's not clear what the consequence of hacking that PC was, but it certainly hacked. Uh, presumably it gives us a relay to bloom nodes in more places or something. <laughs> the world is turning blue. <laughs> hey, we're clear to Delaware. What? He's right, look. Holy we've shit. got access to Delaware. Time to get what we came for. Pretty goddamn spectacular. Let's get him. New Jersey, the ultimate destination. All the Bloom's oh, metadata shit, is, is about this? to be out. This is the big one. You got this. So, remote control drone. Oh, yes, please. Nice. Quadcopting time. Oh, shit. Look at this data. I assume it's data. I mean, it's blue glowing stuff, right? It's either data or mana. Oh, shit. Look at the size of that. Oh, Guys, holy crap. We still got this, right? This is relatively incredible. Frozen automated server rooms. <laughs> Holy crap. I hear the, the whales of some sort of security robot around somewhere. What a heck of a data center. Oh, what's that? Oh, another bot thing. Alright. So, how do I get in there? This blue mistake. This is like a reprise of the very first hack, but way cooler. And the router. Oh shit! Man, they really have this locked down. Well, they would, wouldn't they? I think someone's starting to notice what I'm doing. <laughs> yep, this appears to be really cool. Kind of unlocking the data streams one by one. Hey, Marcus. How's it going? You know, it's a little stressful doing this with all of you watching. Marcus. Marcus. Seriously? You're gonna do this now? Marcus! 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 Shouldn't you guys go fuck yourselves or something? <laughs> uh. Um... Cool, 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 cool. Wow, this is elaborate. I can see why Marcus was complaining. What is that ominous voice that keeps saying ominous stuff? It 
some kind of harmonizer. No, I haven't got this. Ah, yeah, I have got it, actually. I'm left. Alright. I'm set of trees left here. This is so cool. Why are the servers, like, coming to life as I hack them and seeing stuff at me? That's creepy. It, the voice becomes clearer and clearer each time. Could this be the voice of the bellwether? Okay. Okay. Here we go. I'm gonna leave these guys a little memento of my visit. Marcus, what are you up to? Now, uh, it's a surprise. <laughs> what? <laughs> Dushan is yet. about to get work? super Wait mad. For I think. It. <laughs> you see what I did there? Oh, mad skulls, bro. Nice. That's why it was lighting up. Okay, that's the coolest whole reason. Okay. Planet hacked. What exactly did we just download? The internet, I guess? Okay, alright, okay. Oh, guys, guys, look. Look at what, at what, what is, what is, what is, tell me. Uh, it'll take forever to go through all this. Uh, focus on why the satellites are in play. Ah, we've got everything, oh, God, so who knows what it is. Holy love and fuck. It's a backbone. Satellite backbone? For what? What about the latency? There's no way they can match the speed of fiber optics. If I'm reading this right, they are. Bloom did it. They're, they're bypassing the undersea cables with satellites. That's a quantum leap in tech. I mean, if this works, it'll take hackers years to catch up or... Hey, not for us. We're already in. Hey, who's on Bloom's client list? We got Noodle. We got Envite. We got Titus. We got Galloway. Uh... We got the, the government. The New York Stock Exchange. Wait, so all these companies just agreed to up and funnel all their data through... Because Bloom. they advertised it as unhackable. All that data at Bloom's fingertips, that's like... The world's most powerful monopoly. Can we nuke the backbone? No, no, even if we could, we still need answers. Hey, everybody listen up. Our work is far from over, but with this score, at least we're on the playing field. So pick a target. <laughs> Just pick Invite, one. <laughs> Titus, whatever, and start digging. Look for shit they're not supposed to be doing, right? Dushan wants to paint us as an enemy? Let's show him what going to war with us really means. Yeah. 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 Okay, so Bloom's pitch to all these organizations was. Oh, you know what's up? I saw those wheels spinning. Look, I don't want you using Marcus as your personal weapon against Bloom. Where the fuck is this coming from? I know about Raymond Kenny and his great collateral damage. We're using each other here. That was always the deal, Satara. Marcus is a big boy. He knows how to look after himself. Mm -hmm. Sure. Weird. I don't think it's weird. I think she is entirely right. But uh, I just mean it's going to stop. In a free and stop. just society, every person is treated with dignity. What's this? In a free and just society, leaders are accountable to those they govern. And in a free and just society, individuals can rise as far as their talents and hard work will take them. Do you believe your society is just? just. Do you believe you are free? free? Perhaps you trust in the power of democracy, democracy. that your vote counts. Vote, vote. Companies now buy politicians and manipulate elections. 
Do you believe in the power of the free market? The stock exchange is a puppet show for the rich. Your wealth is controlled by people you've never met. Never met. Do you believe the government protects you? protects you? National defense now aims to protect the government from you. Don't take our word for it. Join us as we launch our biggest operation yet and see for yourselves. Yourself. The foundations of U.S. policy have failed us all. Democracy, the free market, national security. Dead you know, will give you the truth. those are some pretty shitty foundations, I've got to say. got to say. So, it doesn't seem like all that big a deal if those quasi-institutions fail. Oh no, without the free market, we're so lost. Cool, that was a cool mission. I think it is over and I will log off. Wait, no, I'm no coward, I will never log off. But I will stop playing the game in a sec as soon as... Unfortunately, there's always these, like, post-mission call-up things. Hey, check this out. Wrench has, at his bench, a picture. Oh, I see her. I Marcus, gotta talk to him. Josh Wait. is swimming through the deep end of the Galilee data, and he's got something he wants to show you. Cool. What's the scale of the thing? Come back home when you can. This might be big. Alright, well, I'll talk to Josh at some point, but first, let's see what Wrench has to say for himself. How's the mask? Kind of itchy. Those FBI motherfuckers must have sprayed it down with some non hypoallergenic bullshit. Bastards. Don't worry. I'm sure it'll smell like you again after a couple of days. Just sweating it. Shouldn't be a problem. After Dead Sex pulled the sheet off of Silicon Valley, what do you think happens next? A lot of people lose money. Examples will be made. The worst offenders will be fired or arrested. We'll do some serious damage for sure. But then it all resets, right? A new product comes out, people forget. One CEO takes a hit for the whole company and everybody moves on. How do we make it stick? We just keep sticking it to them. Oh, we could destroy capitalism. But I don't think that's what these guys want to hear. Okay, see you around.